The Marika family of Arnhem Land could be called the Boyds of the Indigenous art world. Their contribution to Aboriginal art, culture and activism spans generations. And now the paintings, sculptures and songs that tell their story have been collated into a new show at the National Museum here in Canberra. Siobhan Henyu reports. From the sweltering heat of Arnhem Land to the chill of the nation's capital. An artistic dynasty spanning generations and passing on knowledge from old to young. There are still um, living cultures and history still in this country today and um, an opportunity for, for people to um, yeah, learn a bit about our family. The Marika family are not just artists. They've been referred to as cultural diplomats, heavily involved in environmental work and in some of the earliest land rights campaigns. Even at that early stage they understood the importance of cultural brokerage because the paintings were a way of establishing their perspective in a changing world and they've always been very aware of how art can actually be used to negotiate a space for them in a, in a new sort of society. This show brings all that art, culture and history together, three generations worth. We celebrated this special day. <laughs> From crayon drawings from the 1940s to sacred objects and very modern lino cuts, the Marika family have carried their artistic impulse down the ages. <laughs> this is the story of Yalangbara, sacred land, a spiritual site, and these rare works tell the old ancestral stories. But you get the feeling this family's story has only just begun. Siobhan Hinu, ABC News, Canberra.